Type in 3000. It's in the uh, flight level format, so you need to go 030. Okay. We have our Cessna 172 here. Now, in terms of route of flight, we need to change this to user selected routing. Now, right in here, if we were going to checkpoints, like we were, for instance, if we were using another airport as a checkpoint, we would put that in right here, but we're going to go in a direct line. So I'm going to leave that blank. And we're going to be leaving in about 30 minutes from now. So I hit submit request. And it comes up with this flight plan for me right here. So it tells us that the distance right here is 34.2 nautical miles. So I'll write that down. It gives us a magnetic course right here of 273. And it tells us that our true airspeed, our average true airspeed that includes the descent, the cruise, and the climb will be 92 knots. Okay, and it gives us the winds aloft at our altitude. And it tells us that the winds will be coming from 160 at 10. So that's going to give us a tailwind. And it tells us that our ground speed, because of that tailwind right here, GS ground speed, because of the tailwind, we're going to be going over the ground at 97 knots. Put that in right here as our ground speed. OK, and we need to correct for the wind a little bit. It tells us that the heading we need to fly right here is 268. And it gives us a total flight time of 21 minutes. And you can see that right here.